Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Kryptonic and today I'm doing something weird. I'm going to be using my blue Yeti, but I'm going to be holding it just because I really want to try this out again. I did it with my Rode NT-USB microphone and I just want to see how well everything picks up and also if there is any like random sounds that you hear because I'm moving the microphone like this. But anyways guys, today we're going to be talking about the Vogek xbox one controller charger so if you guys don't have enjoying the video make sure to drop a like on it but anyways guys let's get straight into the video now everywhere out there there are different types of xbox one chargers and i feel like this is probably one of the best ones just because it matches your xbox one at least they have different colors i have an xbox one s a white one at that and i really like it because it matches my controllers perfectly now what i think is great is that you can easily charge this by connecting a micro usb cable to your your xbox one through the front usb port and then plugging it into the actual charging base and then you just drop your controllers on there and they will begin charging it does come with two included charging battery banks just so that you plop that into your xbox one controller and you're good to go now another thing i find really neat about the charging base is that when you put them to charge it tells you in the front of it whether it's charging or not how charged it is by giving you a little led to show you the controller whether it's in green or in red which is really useful to know which controller to pick up next time you start gaming besides that though i didn't really see any other problems Problems. I think this is a really really nice and very compact charging base I've always had a charging base when it comes to Xbox one materials because everything seems to die if anything on console dies really quickly My mouse currently for my computer does use batteries and I feel like I wish there was just a battery pack for it Just because you know, I'm tired of buying batteries like once every few months But you know it is what it is and with the Xbox one controller I bought batteries once and I was like I'm never buying batteries again I have to get a battery pack and I did that and and it's just so much better now because everything seems to work so much better and I don't need to constantly be changing the batteries which is such a pain to do and it's very expensive in the long run. If you guys are really interested in this and you're maybe trying to get your parents tell them that it's a long term investment because in the long run they're going to keep paying for batteries and batteries and they just keep getting more and more expensive and rechargeable batteries are not recommended for the Xbox One controllers just because they're not the best but you guys should definitely give it a look because this definitely saved me money down the road that I would have spent on batteries it's just too much of a pain for me because batteries like I said are really expensive mainly for the good ones but anyways guys that has been it for this video let me know down below what you guys are currently using for Xbox one are you using batteries which is you know terrible idea or using a charging case or kit like this because I feel like this is definitely the way to go and if you're on ps4 you don't even have to worry your controllers are already rechargeable so you know I don't even know why you're here if you have a ps4 but you know you could just check out other accessories for your ps4 in the meantime anyways guys thank you Thank you so much for watching hopefully you guys have a great day this has been kryptonic and i will see you guys around and i'm out peace guys